Okay, this is uh, iRacing official race in IMSA, Watkins Glen, 45-minute race. Uh, I did this race yesterday, and it was a Charlie Foxtrot event. It was horrible. Um, I was knocked around, battered. That's really hot, too. Guys dive bombing. Um, just like just a complete shit show. No joke. Um, I lost 74. Yeah, the bus stop is where I was making up all my time in practice, and I just couldn't get through there as well as I was before. So, so 74 loss I rating. Uh, and I lost a, a decent amount of safety rating with 13 incident points in three laps. So it was a horrible, horrible thing. I'm hoping to redeem myself a little bit in this, although I'm starting about the same as I did yesterday. It was a 1.5K strength of field yesterday. It's a 1.4K strength of field today. Um, and uh, I am car number 31 uh, in terms of I rating stack in this 38 car grid. Uh, went managed to qualify 21st. So I'm above where my car number says I am, but still not, not very far up in the field. It's going to be a long race. Uh, I just want to stay out of trouble, man. I just want to finish this one. So, um, by the way, a uh, new camera angle. Um, I don't know what you guys think of it. I'm not sure what I think of it. I think it's a little weird, um, but it's kind of how my rig came together uh, in the move. We got a new house. And uh, so uh, setting things up, uh, did some adjustments here and there. One of them is in the camera placement. So it's a little bit above me into the center now. So I'm looking up and I don't know. It feels weird. It feels like a Peter Gabriel video. Just oh, like I fast forward and moving around either. really fast. Oh boy. So um, <laughs> we'll see how Big old GT3 race. Same as yesterday, exclusively GT3. This series does have lmp 2 minutes. The track temp is 118. The air temp is 82. Good work, good but not here. Follow car number zero, four. Wow. to catch up to car number zero four. So that's interesting. You can't even do a decent parade lap. This was the same way yesterday too. There was a guy that actually uh, wrecked in the parade lap yesterday. So I'm sure you can see on screen, but if you cannot, uh, track temp is 118 degrees Fahrenheit. Catch up to car number zero, four. And of course, uh, this is a uh, prelude to the six hours at the Glen that's going on this Saturday. Um, Schadenfreude Fodder will be in that race. Um, so Rob Cottle, Jeff Williams, Jeff Rosenthal, and myself uh, will be driving that race. Um, and quite frankly, i got to tell you, I'm terrified after yesterday's <laughs> race. We'll see if today actually is a, a little bit of a mellowing experience for me. But uh, I thought the AI racers or drivers were uh, difficult and uh, kind of a-holes. And yesterday, the, the real-life drivers brought a whole new level to the, uh, the phrase. So um, it'll be interesting to see uh, how Saturday goes.
Okay, Chip. Nice and neat. Stay out of trouble. Green, let's go, let's go. No dive bombs, no dive bombs. You guys are a bunch of doofuses. So that was heroin. And there's no LMP, that's the problem. And this is like arc and break. Damn it, all the fucking hell. Damn it.
Great place to try to pass there in the S's. All right, Chip, the next car is Pinson. Yellow flag, watch out. Come on, man. Car in front of us is Brian. The gap to Pinson ahead is now 6.2 seconds. Lap time was 147.67. That's your fastest lap. That's just sad. But I'm driving very tentatively right now. And I know it. Okay, Chip. We think our refueling window will open after 60 minutes and closes after 36 minutes. This race and the race yesterday really reminded me how long it's been since I've raced yeah, competitively. Ahead is now 5.7 seconds. So I think my last race was in April. Because it's not just being able to drive fast or control the car in practices or with AI even it's about handling the nerves a little bit too while you're driving with real humans whoops and that like anything else needs practice too
one is 0.7 off the pace. But So Pinson in front is now 4.8 seconds. I'm going to hit you there. Yeah, yeah. Another guy named Ship in the race. It's kind of uh, kind of unusual. Okay, Chip, you're reeling pins and in the gaps now. 4.1 seconds. leaving the pit lane. Yellow flag, keep your wits about you, mate. Give you 
used half your fuel. Uh oh. Slower car ahead. We're racing this guy for position. Don't expect a blue flag. Nice save, by the way, Tyler. Sorry about that. like here we're on the same lap sector one is 1.1 seconds off the pace don't know when the world will ever see two chips on track at the same time again <laughs> yeah right <laughs> that's pretty funny Okay, Chip. Pit window is open. That is my ringtone. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Thanks for all your break times. Good job. Coming up on a slower class car. All right, Chip. The next car is Inza. Come on, man. Yellow flag. Oh man, sucks, dude. Dodge it, no. He counters accidents for you to come and tell me the wheel like that. Come on. I was aiming for a thing race here. If you care that much, just go. Do my pit stop now. The pit 
Pilot lane speed limit is 40 miles per hour. We'll fill you to the end of the race. <laughs> this is a horrible pit entry. But I got the rev to the speeding feet. tickets okay, coming Jim. through the pits here. 10 minutes of fuel remaining. 100 feet. Exit's clear. Stay behind the white line. Okay, Chip. Halfway home. Fuel looks good. Leader's like eight seconds pitting. behind me. In front is pitting. B26. really tentative coming through the bus stop now for some reason. I don't know if it's psychological or what it is. I'm overthinking it instead of just driving. That's your quickest lap in this session. That's 20 minutes to go.
Thank you. Chip. There's a car exit in the pits. Heads up. The lead car's pitting. B24. That lap time was 147.77. Uh oh. Thanks, Roger. Just decrease it. It's now 113 Fahrenheit. <laughs> Cigar exit in the pits. Sector one is 0.7 off the pace. Slower car ahead. This guy's on our lap. He won't get a blue flag. He's racing us for position. Thank you. Thanks, Joe. The lap time was at 148.22.
the flag. Back to my starting position, at least. <laughs> Gonna take another bath with irating, I think. Oh well. find a better series to farm for I rating I guess. field. I'm not sure uh, how many cars will actually get positive I rating. Probably at least the top 15. And depending upon where the high I rating uh, drivers finish. Because it's a zero sum game. For everybody that wins, somebody loses. Okay, Chip. Come on, stay focused. Apexes and exits, apexes and exits. 20th place, good consistency, keep them coming. Sector three is 0.9, off the pace. That was an aggressive way through the bus stop. Chip, 10 minutes to go, that's 10 minutes left. That was right on the edge. This guy is faster than I am. Thank you. You're faster than me, man. I Slow recognize it. Slow ahead. This guy won't get a blue flag because he's racing us for position.
91. That lap was a 148.66. So I injured my hand in our move, and it is starting to hurt. <laughs> Just a little bit. Sector 3 is 0.5 off the pace. Need to remember to ibuprofen up on Saturday. Okay, Jet. Five minutes to go. Five minutes left. I was worried about that guy behind me, but he just spun. That tends to reduce the worry just a little. He has taken out a second of me in the last, like, two or three laps, so I was, like, figuring he was going to be, uh next on my I'll let you buy list, but... The guy directly behind me is uh, a lap down to me, so I can let him by without any consequence. The next guy for position, I think, is uh, Derek. So two is 2.5 seconds off the pace who is a serious piece back.
As long as I keep it on the track, I should be okay for this position at least. Why did I downshift? Don't need to downshift there. Should mean I get the white flag next time. Bye. Less predictable. Sector two is one point four seconds off the pace. This track is really tough on the left side tires. Especially in the heat. Hey Nick, are you in a Porsche? One more. I don't know if it's just me, but the Porsche seems like it's kind of like ice. one more lap. Porsche stuck here, man. All right, Chip. We estimate you've got five minutes of fuel remaining. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sector one is zero point three six off the pace. Good battle there, Landon. We <laughs> it looks like we both fucked up at the bus stop. That was funny. I think that's a mild overestimation, Jim. Got three corners and I'm done. You didn't have to give that back, Nick. The car in front of us is now Owen. Yay! Finished! P20, there's the checkered flag. Ooh, we'll check out the results. Well, um, didn't look like the car was too worse for wear despite that uh, early lap incident uh, where I got turned around. And at the end of the day, things weren't quite as bad as I had imagined that they were. Um, I'm not sure if all the split detail has come in yet, but this looks like that was the third um, split uh, at this particular time of day. Um, safety rating uh, plus 01 uh, for the four <laughs> incidents and uh, plus one on the I rating change. So, I mean, at least I didn't lose more. Um, I didn't gain as much as I had hoped I would have, but um, all things being equal, um, there we go. Um, Richard McClure, Logan Brakely, and Landon Pedronos? Padronos? 
I'm not sure how to pronounce that, um, were our uh, podium finishers. Um, Richard, of course, had the best lap of a 145.2, which is pretty decent in that temperature. Um, I've I've done laps in the 145s, but um, just could not. Uh, could not turn good laps here. I think part of it was the, the damage to my car um, from early on, but uh, overall, um, I did okay with despite having having some challenges there. Overall, pay, race pace was not that far off of the the top finisher, so it, not horrible. My fastest lap was a one forty seven two, so full two seconds off uh, the fastest lap. Not happy about that. Again, I tend to drive in the 146s and can hit the 145. So this was, I think, a result of just that early damage that I took. Uh, four incident points, and you can see um, we're littered with folks that uh, had a rough ride for sure. Um, biggest losers down here at the bottom, which is where I was uh, yesterday uh, in a 35 car field. Um, but you see 97 points down here is the biggest loser. Our winner, I think, uh, topped us out with the biggest I rating gain of 101. So good on him. And um, that makes for a good race. Anyway, it's uh, week one in season three. So um, anything can happen. I'm going to try to compete um, a little bit more regularly this season now that I got my rig back together. The move is done. Um, I've got uh, some summer fun racing going on in PCA Sim Racing. And, uh, you know, that's always fun, right? Uh, PCA Sim Racing uh, is doing a lot of fun tracks. We're doing things a little bit differently in that league where we're actually uh, doing the major race every other week and the intervening weeks are preludes to the upcoming race week. Um, so it gives people a chance to take a breath, um, do summer stuff and uh, race when they want to race. Um, and I think we're supporting multiple drops and that sort of thing in a, uh, a I think a nine race season, we're changing cars uh, through. So we're using three cars in the series. It's a fun series. So um, if you get a chance to watch uh, the videos or even uh, um, catch anybody else that might be streaming, uh, do so because uh, it should be a hoot. Um, and iRacing going to be doing some uh, more uh, of the IMSA series we'll do GT3 again um, probably play around with the Radical although that SR10 scares the bejesus out of me it's a, a tough car to control um, played a little bit about a road Atlanta in that car and that was fun and of course we've got the Porsche Cup Porsche Cup is always fun and I tend to enjoy driving that car more now that I've driven other things, um, it's usually the drivers that are kind of nuts in a lot of the other series. The Porsche Cup car uh, is the crazy one in most of those races, and most people are afraid of it, so they drive it differently. So I actually enjoy those races a little bit more. Anyway, um, I'm glad they're done enough. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you did enjoy what you saw, please uh, give me a like. Um, and if you want to see more content from me, um, content from PCA Sim Racing, content from North America Racing League, or I racing official races as you just saw. Um, go ahead and subscribe, and uh, you'll get uh, you'll get on my notification list of new videos, which is always fun. Thanks a lot. Take care. Spaß machen Rennsport.